Chapter 13 Directions, Distance and Time We have many public places in our surroundings. In order to know the exact position and location of these places, we need to know their directions. The day is divided into different parts, known as time. Let's share the information about the direction, distance and time. Directions We have four directions. North, South, East and West. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. The directions are opposite to each other. The east is opposite to the west and north is opposite to south. Look at this picture. The direction in which the sun rises is called the east. The boy is facing the rising sun. Behind him is the west. The sun sets in the west. The boy's left hand points to the north and his right hand points to the south. So, we must remember A. There are four main directions. B. They are east, west, north and south. C. Two sets of directions are opposite to each other. The west is opposite to east and the south is opposite to the north. D. The sun rises in the east every morning. E. It sets in the west every evening. Distance Let us look at this picture. Look at this boy. His name is Rahul. He is standing near the table. The window is far away. Rahul's house is close to the school. So he walks to the school. His teacher's house is quite far away, so the teacher comes by car to school. Rahul's friend Sonia's house is far away from the school, so she comes to school by bus. When we use the words near, close, far away, quite far, it refers to the distance of the place. Time If we talk about time, we refer to day and night. The daytime is the time when the sunlight is there and at night it is dark. The day is divided into three parts. That is, morning, afternoon and evening and the night also consists of three parts that is night midnight and dawn let's share the information about different day morning it is the time when the sun rises in the east our shadow is longer in the morning the flowers bloom in the morning and the birds start chirping. We get up early in the morning, brush our teeth, take a bath and get ready for the school. Mom sprinkles water in front of the house and makes a beautiful rangoli. After that we have our breakfast. We can also see people going to their work in the morning. Afternoon The sun is overhead in the afternoon. So, the shadow becomes short in the noon and it is almost near our feet. 
It is very hot in the afternoon. We have our lunch in the afternoon and after that we take rest. The breeze is warm during this time. Evening The sun sets in the evening in the west direction. The shadow again becomes longer in the evening. In the evening we have our snacks and go out for playing. Slowly and slowly the light becomes less and all the people return from their workplace. Night One Night At this time it seems that moonlight is spread everywhere and stars twinkle in the sky. We have our dinner and go to bed. The breeze is cool and pleasant at night. 2. Midnight At midnight we are in deep sleep. This is the time when there is no noise at all. 3. Dawn This is the time when the chirping of the birds start. It is the most pleasant and delightful time of the day. At this time, the breeze is cool. Now, let us do some activities to remember directions, distance and time. 1. Write the time of the sentences described below using the words given in the brackets. Evening Dawn, noon, morning, midnight, night. First, it is quiet everywhere. Midnight. Second, this is the most pleasant and delightful time. Dawn. Third, we have breakfast at this time. Morning. Fourth, the sun sets at this time. Evening. Fifth, the shadow is at our feet. Noon. Sixth, the sound of the cricket is heard at this time. Night. Two. Match the following. The direction opposite to the west. East. The direction in which the sun sets. West. The direction opposite to the south. North. The direction behind us when we face the sun. South. 3. Look at the picture and fill in the blanks with the words given in the brackets. Near, far, quite far. First, the boy is standing, the car. Near. Second, the tree is from the boy. Far. Third, the building is from the boy. Quite far. Fourth, the building is from the tree. Quite far. Name the following. The three periods of time of the day. Morning, afternoon, evening. The three periods of time of the night. Night, midnight, dawn. The words used to mention distance. Far away, quite far away, close. 
the four main directions. North, South, East, West.